Hyper-threading off is meta in Tomb Raider? Probably. You're probably right, dude. <laughs> I'm not downloading NVIDIA Inspector, man. It's not that serious. The second... We'll, we'll talk about the consult story in a second. Um... The second you have to install NVIDIA Inspector, you've lost the plot on gaming. Now now you're a tweaker. You're not a gamer anymore. That, well, if, if you're going for 3D Mark scores, yeah, I, th I think that's fair game. Because um, 3D Mark scores are a game in itself. So maybe doing tertiary timings would work for 3d mark and then yeah go for it because that's 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 a separate hobby though right i'm sure i'm sure geek bench and um whatever those guys do on hardware bot i'm sure that that's a separate hobby man if that's your goal then fucking nvidia inspector away they use like atlas windows they do like optimization tweaks on top they do like tcp packet optimizer they there's like seven different power plans their 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 timings are all fucked um like less man oh my god dude less is more guys the reason why people do that shit in the first place is because they don't know why they're bad at games or they they don't they 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 think there's some secret optimization or they think there's some secret fucking thing the reason why they keep losing their games i think it was kobe bryant or somebody said i can't remember i think it was kobe you have to meet people where they're at and you can't force them to evolve to another paradigm which is the idea behind clickbait um so so if if you are if your brain is like i need the optimizer shit i need to disable usb ports the reason i can't compete is because my router isn't fucking optimized i don't if you're in that paradigm no matter what i say you're not gonna believe me no you can't you're not gonna you're not gonna believe me um if if i'm like your p the fact that you needed NVIDIA Inspector to fix some random ass problem about crashing, you're not going to believe me. You're, you're going to be like, I need more NVIDIA Inspector. Eventually, though, when, well, not, not everybody, but hopefully with enough wastage of time, it usually comes down to wasting fucking time. Um eventually people will be like wow i just wasted the last year and i'm still bronze five so maybe jufus was right after the person has to come to the paradigm themselves i can scream from the heavens you don't need optimization apps but uh people just have to go through that journey themselves dude all my god supporters 12900k 12900ks 13900k 13900ks 14900k, 14900ks. They bought six CPUs for the same socket, and each one is 100 megahertz more. And some of them had to buy six CPUs before they're like, "This is not that serious." But the but every single one, I'm like, "It's not that serious, bro." <laughs> I I can. I, I'm tr I'm trying I'm trying to save my supporters money by saying bro it's not going to help you but they had to buy all six of them to reach that paradigm of thought that's just the way humans are man it's just the way they are dude yeah metaphor so okay so yeah metaphor is uh happier than a pig in shit with his computer he, he again another another example he bought a PC from uh some fucking Reese dude, FPS Reese or some crazy shit. Um never even fucking heard of this guy before. I'm like, what are you what are you doing 
Stop buying fucking... Stop buying shit from Twitter optimizers, man. Stop. I think that Reese guy just disappeared after I fucking fixed Metaphor's PC. So, Metaphor's PC was crashing for like an entire year. And, and this Reese guy couldn't fix it. I fixed it in 10 minutes. <gasps> literally 10 minutes i 10 minutes i'm not i'm not exaggerating i fixed it in 10 minutes i remote it in i'm like it's this metaphor bought a backup cpu he was going to replace all the fucking components reese was like it has to be <laughs> fucking reese said that metaphors 13900 ks or whatever was degraded and that's why it was crashing guess what it wasn't fucking that i fixed it in 10 minutes 10 minutes oh my god i if, if you're watching jay's video you're you're on the wrong channel man i you're on the wrong channel good luck again um go go install nvidia inspector and good luck but anyway i fixed the i fixed the computer in 10 fucking minutes um and uh he's like damn it i'm like yeah dude the difference between somebody that's been doing this for years and a guy who just spams twitter um so anyway i built him that new computer and i here's the here's the um the moral of the story, the whole the whole metaphor thing is fantastic because before before I built metaphor that computer, well, because before he had like the thirteen or the fourteen, I don't, I don't remember what fucking Intel CPU he had a fourteen hundred K or some shit, right? And then uh, he's like, "Should I upgrade to the ninety eight hundred X three D?" I'm like, "No, it's not gonna feel any different at all, man." I'll just to I'll just fix this Reese shit and just it'll be fine, right? Uh he just wanted a new rig though. Um I think he I think he just wanted to clean his hands of that fucking garbage that he had. It just, it just felt tainted even if I did fix it. So I'm like, okay, well, you know what we'll do? So uh uh I did this on purpose. I'm like, let me tune this one and you play on it while I build this one, then when I ship you this one, try to be as objective as possible because this one is going to have way more FPS and COD, right? Way more average FPS and COD. And I'm like, try to be as objective as possible and see if you can visually see or feel a difference even though the fps is higher and then after about a week he's like there's no difference at all I'm like yeah, fuck it. <laughs> yeah dude yeah just because the number in the top left and i got an esports pro to fucking say that on mouse and keyboard right so just because the average fps is higher on this one does not mean you get a better gaming experience right now, why is he so happy with this one? Just because I it's uncrashable. He can stream for 14 hours a day and it doesn't crash because I, I tuned it for him that way, right? It, it's like a, a, a streamer is far more concerned with reliability because they lose. He was losing when when he bought this PC from Reese, that whatever that guy's name was, it wasn't just the cost of the PC that he was. It was the opportunity cost of his PC constantly crashing and his viewers getting fed up and not subscribing. So the he paid far more for this computer because he bought it from the wrong person. Think of the, think of how many thousands of dollars he lost. Because of the PC crashing. Because he bought it from a Twitter optimizer. Right? He buys this one for me. Doesn't crash a single time in 24 hour streams. He's making money off of the... He's making money off of the PC that I built for him that he paid me for. And that's that's how exchange of value is supposed to work. Right? Um, you build a flawless product. The guy is very happy with your service. 
he shouts you out. I got like 10 course orders from that guy. So I, I made like four grand off of his referrals too, right? And then he makes more money with sub money because he gets to be live for 16 hours a day and not have his PC crash, right?